Good day everyone, my name is Daniel Kumaran and today I'll be talking about clinical task number one. So let me read the question first. A patient has been admitted into the burn care ward. He has a thermal burn of about 40% of the body surface of the back, thighs and the chest. The injured area is literary and chariot. A nurse has inserted a foley catheter and an intravenous line. So the first question. Think about what procedures you will include in your care of the patient. So um, the normal care plan will include promoting gas exchange and airway clearance, restoring fluids and electrolyte balance in the patient, minimizing patient pain and anxiety, monitoring and managing potential complications that may arise, and helping the patient out with any of their needs. The second question, what sort of bed is preferable for such patients? How does it function? So um, a burn recover bed can be used for the patient, which works by distributing the weight of the patient so evenly that no single bed contact point is pressed harder than any other. Question number three, what is the Foley catheter needed for in this patient? So, um, Peripheral vascular resistance marked increasingly and cardiac output decrease in the early stages after thermal injury. Thus, it is very important at, for the patient to have a Foley catheter to monitor the patient urine output. Question number four, does the person need dressing? Yes, the person needs a simple dressing to treat the burn wounds at the same time to provide the patient with some privacy. Question number five, what type of bandaging can be used? Um, not Non-adherent films or fine mesh gauge in combination with topical antimicrobials are uh, common dressing used to cover the burn wounds, but films, foams, alginates, hydrocolytes, and hydrogels can also be used depending on the specific qualities of the dressing.